During his upcoming visit to Washington, President Moon Jae-in vowed to focus on gaining support to turn South Korea into a global hub for vaccine production. Hopes are high he can work to ease concerns over vaccine procurement at the meeting with his American counterpart, where likely key topics include cooperation on semiconductors and North Korea. Kim Min-ji outlines what to expect. One of the key topics of discussion at the South Korea-U.S. summit in Washington this Friday will be a vaccine partnership. President Moon Jae-in has vowed to use his talks with President Joe Biden to boost cooperation with the U.S. and use it as an opportunity to develop South Korea as a global vaccine hub. Possible agreements include a vaccine swap, which would mean Seoul receives surplus shots from Washington and gives the same amount back at a later date. Another option is technology transfer by manufacturing vaccines in South Korea using original U.S. technology. Another key topic that could be on the table is the global semiconductor shortage, with Washington seeking cooperation from Seoul to address the matter. In fact, a South Korean business entourage, which includes representatives from Samsung Group and SK Group, is expected to accompany President Moon. There's speculation that Samsung Electronics, the world's biggest memory chip producer, will unveil plans to build a new chip factory in the U.S. during Moon's visit. Last but not least, North Korea. The summit comes as Washington completes its policy review on Pyongyang. Attention will be on whether the leaders can agree on measures to resume dialogue with North Korea during their first face-to-face sit-down and how specific their joint statement will be. Depending on the achievements President Moon brings back from the summit with President Biden, it could give him more leverage in state affairs during the final year of his term.